Hi everyone. Thank you for your interest in learning more about the LGBTQ Communities Advocacy Education and Youth Programs. This program is built upon unconditional acceptance of sexual orientation, gender expression, and identity. We offer a variety of different programs and services to the community. Um, we have our youth and young adult programs, which offer social and educational groups for LGBTQ youth and young adults to meet other peers, participate in different in-group activities and events. We also do have our mental health department that offers uh, mental health support to LGBTQ youth and new adults. We have our youth leadership group called Youth Empowered to Act, which is a great space for youth who are interested in building their youth leadership and community organizing experience. We also do have QChat space, which is a weekly space that we offer to LGBTQ youth that is solely chat-based where they can participate in facilitated conversations and discussions. And then of course we have activities and events that take place on an ongoing basis. At this time, all our activities and events are virtual. Please visit our website or social media for the latest information about this. We do offer education. Um, we do offer a group called Study with Pride that provides tutoring supports for LGBTQ youth um, with topics related to STEM and writing. We have an ongoing year-round literacy program that offers literacy education on certain topics, such as employment and college preparedness, financial literacy through a queer and trans inclusive lens, as well as advocacy through writing. For advocacy, we do have our youth leadership group called Youth Empowered to Act, which meets on Tuesdays and Thursdays. This is a group for LGBTQ youth and their allies who are interested in building their leadership experience as well as their community organizing experience in the community too. Um, this group provides opportunities for youth to advocate on issues that are important to them within their schools and within their communities. We also do offer support to gender and sexualities alliances, um, their students, um, their student members, as well as teacher advisors. We can help with providing um, different events. Um, so supporting events that take place on campus that are relevant to LGBTQ issues, as well as providing advocacy and education. In terms of education, we're happy to provide ongoing educational workshops on a variety of different topics um, that relate to the community. Um, we also do advo uh, provide advocacy at the school level too where we have youth who advocate for inclusive curricula, anti-bullying policies, as well as policies that uplift transgender students. We have a group called uh, Youth First OC, which is a group or coalition of LGBTQ students, youth, parents, teachers, community members that also advocate for inclusive policies and spaces for LGBTQ youth and schools. In terms of school policies, we also do advocate on behalf of these school policies, like we mentioned above. So advocating for inclusive curricula, anti-bullying policies, policies that support transgender students, as well as creating space for LGBTQ students on their campuses. And then of course, also relying on community engagement. So providing support and engagement for community members who would like to get part, to be part of um, advocacy, um, or advocacy related activities and events in the community here in Orange County. We always welcome new folks to participate in this program. So please join us. You can visit us at bit.ly slash center zoom 20 for zoom meeting information. We're also on Instagram and we have additional information that's posted on our website. Feel free to contact Stephanie Camacho Van Dyke, Director of Advocacy and Education. Um, as well as Wendy Evans, who's our advocacy and education assistant, for further details and information. Thank you for watching.